Hey, welcome to this video. So, I want to show you guys this voxel game I've been working on. And so, what well, is basically, this is basically one mesh, and I just um, put it together procedurally. And so, it's like Minecraft, it has voxels and stuff, except in this, I have physics. So, if I build this wall, I'm going to make it a little bit bigger. And so now I have a big wall, so I can just like um try to break it somewhere, so like there. And then you can actually kind of see that it's multiple pieces now. And yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. But there's actually more. So if I break the bottom of that, it's just one big piece. It just sticks together. So I'll just show you this by making a tree. Let's just imagine that looks this looks like a tree. I just built this. And so, yeah, it's just... um one mesh and now I can break the broad bottom like that and so you see it falls and then it falls over. It's just all it's just one mesh with a rigid body on it and you can actually split it into multiple pieces too like that. And so I thought that was pretty cool. Like that um I have only been working on this for a week so it's not like perfected but I think it's pretty cool still. So sometimes like something like that happens. I haven't really read why. Um, yeah, I haven't really found out why, but it's just because I've only been working on this for a week. I haven't perfected everything yet. So let me make another one that should look more like a tree, an actual one. So I actually use this flood fill alg algorithm I wrote and it actually um, detects if it's touching the ground and that's how it knows if it should add a rigid body and so then it falls and yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to see more of this kind of stuff. I'm still developing this and I'll make a bunch of progress videos so please subscribe to see those.